An expensive pie in the sky project or a critical investment to help grow downtown. Those are two ways to look at the city's $379 million plan to bring the Skyway down to earth. On your side's Brianna Ray Turner shows you where it would go. JTA plans to expand the Skyway into five new neighborhoods. Right now, the Skyway runs to two and a half miles and the extension would make it 10 miles. The Skyway coming down from the sky. That's the headline of JTA's plan. Doing so with the existing technology, the existing Skyway vehicles, the monorail, uh, with elevated structures, uh, it was going to be cost prohibitive. The first phase of the project will be the autonomous vehicles on Bay Street. JTA is calling the project the ultimate urban circulator. That will cost the city over $300 million. The 10-mile system will interconnect various neighborhoods to downtown. The big uh, mountain to climb is the conversion of the actual current Skyway, the two and a half miles from the monorail to the roadway. Nathaniel Ford, the CEO of GTA, says this major infrastructure project will take time. Probably on Bay Street Innovation Corridor, two to three years. It could be easily five years to even seven years before we actually have uh, the Skyway fully converted and the extensions into the neighborhoods. Ford says JTA's responsibility is looking at a whole street strategy and looking at their previous projects in the past year, they've done it well. We're on a road show right now in terms of uh, capabilities and uh, the JTA's expertise. The CEO of JTA says he wants this done right and with that it's going to take time. In Jacksonville, Brown Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side.